Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant, and today we have for you a 2005 Mercedes-Benz S350. What is very special about this car is it's travelled a genuine 60,000 kilometres from new and has a full Mercedes-Benz service history. It's got four very new Pirelli tyres on it, and it's blue-black in colour with beige interior. It's absolutely stunning. The wood grain looks like new, as you would expect. The car has been garaged. Sometimes you see low-kilometre cars like this, and although they have 60,000 kilometres, they may have been parked outside for 10 years. This is not one of those cars. I used to own a S350 very similar to this. I can honestly say it was easily one of the best cars I've ever had. It's powerful, economical, safe, and it looks like a million bucks. You've got plenty of leg room in the back. You don't need to get a long wheelbase. Surprisingly, the fuel consumption is very good on the S350 as well. It's not really necessary to buy a 430 or a 500 in this newer series. The S350 was the updated W220 series which was released in Australia in 1999 and this was the last of the 220 series. Personally I quite like having the last of the series, it just means that you get all the lovely updates like this has the newer headlights and the new engine. All the tools are there, it's got a full size spare. I've taken a photo of all the log books and service history. The car does have tinted windows, which has certainly helped in keeping the leather in lovely condition. All the panels appear to be in excellent condition as well. It's nice and straight. There's a few marks on the front and rear bumper, as to be expected. But if you've been looking for an S350 and you're looking for one with low kilometres and you want to get the last of the series, you want to get the car with the updated navigation. I think this is it. We've had three S350s over the past few months with low kilometres. And they've all sold very quickly. There weren't a lot of options with these cars. It came standard with memory, electric seats, wood grain, a two-way glass sunroof, dual zone climate control, and a Tiptronic transmission. Another way you can tell that this car has been garaged is by the headlights. You can see they're nice and clear. They also came standard with front and rear parking sensors, rain sensing wipers and automatic headlights. You can see here those Pirelli tyres are very very good. It's got ventilated disc brakes, which is a standard on an S-Class. You can see all the switches are in very good condition. They usually start to go funny around here. If they've been parked in the sun, they react outside. As I said, the timber's lovely. It's got two remote keys to it as well. I'll just start the car. Put the key in, the steering wheel goes down. As you can see, 60,000 kilometres. It's got the newer navigation screen. It's also got a standard adjustable suspension, so at the click of a button, you can put the suspension up a few centimetres if you're going into a steep driveway. At the same time, you can also stiffen the suspension using this button for cornering. You can see the navigation up there. I think you can put a, a CD in here as well. If you can see there, that's where you put your CD in. Press any key to continue. It's a very clever system. So in conclusion, if you're looking for a 220 series Mercedes-Benz and you want to buy what we think is one of the best available at the present time in the country, 
we think you should have a look at this car, take it for a drive, you're just not going to be disappointed. It's absolutely stunning from every angle. Thanks again for watching and we look forward to hearing from you.